Who is Randy Van Scoy? Oh my heavens. <laughs> grew up on a farm, two brothers. We had uh, cows and chickens and a huge garden. We learned the work ethic early on. Hard work pays off. And I worked for another company for nine years and just kept thinking that if I were in command, I could do things differently, do things better. And just took the opportunity and went ahead and started the company and haven't looked back since. Pathmaster, we continue to grow because of our customer service and because of our reputation. We care about each other, so then that extends into caring about the company and how it does. We support what we sell. We don't look for outside help. We don't need the manufacturers to come in to help us. We have field engineers out in the field that support our product, make sure that it's turned on properly, troubleshoot if necessary. My job is to make sure our company, number one, has products that we can sell for the future. We make sure we're aligning ourselves with what we feel are the best products in the market. When we put a product out in the field, it's our name first. Our brand is very important. We have 218 systems in Ohio that are currently using Ares. Ares is an old closed loop system. We cannot upgrade them anymore. They're unsupported and once the masters start to fail, we, we can't replace them. So there was a huge problem here in Ohio. Is we don't have any way of upgrading these customers. A lot of them are small, anywhere from five to 25 intersections. You know, typical central systems are, you know, 100 intersections or more. Initially, uh, we refused to sign up with AI twice. My people had such a hard time describing what an FMU at that time was. Finally, Klenion was able to, you know, show its capabilities, and uh, I saw it right away as a, an inexpensive, reliable comm for a central system. We're supplying applied information so that our customers can view remotely anything about their traffic. Yeah, we can drop an AI unit into a cabinet with a cobalt, and instantly that cabinet, that intersection, is able to communicate to our hosted Centrax system. It makes these now available to any size city allow them to update their timing plans, monitor what's going on at that intersection, check out their battery backups, look at their conflict monitors, see what's going on out there. And everything that you need for that Centrax system, it's all available through that AI com. We watch what's going on at that system every single day. The customer will also get alerts, but we'll get alerts immediately, and if we see that they don't fix it, we can help them take care of it. And you get the SPAT messages that you're set up then for connected vehicle in the future. You shouldn't have to be in a big city with an IT department and a big engineering staff to be able to get the technology that's available every single day.